Hello to all of you, I'm Yulia, part of Teach for Bulgaria team, currently working as a teacher training specialist. So, I come from Bulgaria, which is a small country in southeastern part of Europe, and which also have incredible natural resources and climate. We are increasingly experiencing extreme heat followed by massive floods that show the impacts of human-caused climate change. Right now, we are witnessing the hottest winter ever with just one week of snow and temperatures above 10 degrees. That makes more and more Bulgarians see the importance of addressing climate change for their own lives. However, climate change still needs to be present in Bulgarian schools. And even though a lot of teachers recognize the importance of the topic and are willing to work on it, they share that they don't feel confident and that they do need resources, especially on the part regarding students' ages. This is the main reason why we've created the guidebook Understanding Climate Change. It is a set of ready-to-use materials for students and teachers in middle and high school, which is led by the project-based learning method. This gives both students and teachers the opportunity to take a bit deeper into specific issues or topics and to then work together with their community to find a suitable solution for everyone. So, we've tested our materials with teachers from 12 different schools from the whole country, uh, teachers who are working with diverse school grades, and we also managed to receive feedback from them on each step of the whole process and on each lesson from the uh, learning guide. At the end, we've managed to gather all students to present their work. It was an event here in Sofia last year, and it was really something full of energy, full of inspiration, where we saw students suggesting ways of optimizing their school energy use and also lead workshops on reusing materials. There were other students who wanted to create the permaculture gardens in their schoolyards and to engage more of their community in sustainable living. And this has totally convinced us that climate education is something which inspires students to be real agents of change in their communities and to and be engaged in the process of improving the world around them. So after the event, we've got three months to adapt our materials. And then in September, we've uh, released it in the online communities of educators uh, in our country. Uh, and it was actually uh, really, really well welcomed from uh, all of them. Uh, we've got two webinars with more than 400 people from the whole country. And for less than three months, we've reached more than 3,000 downloads. Uh, that was a bit surprising for us, but also it was very motivating and very uh, exciting to see that so much teachers from the whole country are willing to work on the topic and that they are searching for materials and ideas on how to do it better. I really hope that next year our team will be able to share with you much more and concrete examples of collective leadership initiatives and also very specific guidelines on how to work this process out.